Hello, this is Gary Wishon, the Happy Heathen. In my last video, I cautioned against people raising a hand to the atypical Muslim. Because, quite frankly, obviously, not the atypical Muslim is a fucking terrorist. <clears throat> I caution people to leave it to the authorities to handle the issue. If you attack somebody just because they're Muslim, you're an idiot. If, and also, on a personal note, the person you attack might not be Muslim. I have a nephew who's very, very light-skinned African-American, and people often confuse him. People, I don't know why the fuck people give a goddamn can care about skin tone, but his is so light, the simple-minded are confused by it. So, please, report anything you see, but don't act on it! Every time you do, you make a potential fucking terrorist somewhere down the road. Alright, uh, one of my subscribers, Jim Ribbon, I'm sorry I've messed up your name, I'll leave a link to his channel, sorry if I misplayed, mis said it, asked, what do you, what do we do then? I have a couple of suggestions, first and foremost. If you're not a racist, stop being scared about being called a racist. It's this, it's this paralyzing fear, this appeasement that governments and, and legal entities and municipalities have that fucking true racists, in other words, extremist Muslims, use. Stay secular. Fight to stay secular. Don't pander. I know it's hard because politicians everywhere are cheap whores. If there's enough of a whiny ass ultra liberal and enough Muslims, they will pander to the whiny ass liberal and Muslims and do what they want because they're a cheap whore. Organize and become a voting block to stay secular. Secularism protects everyone. <sighs> Number two, get off of oil, at least as much as you possibly can. <sighs> Gulf states pay off terrorist organizations not to attack them. Saudi Arabia helped finance 9-11, but because they have all the oil and a lot of money, uh, we invaded Iraq instead of them. Oh, we need to get the fuck off of oil. You want to damage terrorists, get off of oil. At least for transportation fuel. I mean, we'll still need it for fertilizer and for plastics, but hundreds of other applications. We're eventually going to have to get to an alternative transportation fuel anyway, because oil is not an unlimited resource. The sooner we move on that, the more damage can be done to terrorists. Moving on. Oh, wait, I have to do the invocation. Not all Muslims and our followers of Islam are terrorists. All the bleeding hearts happy now? Is your inner child happy? Stop pandering to these fuckers. We, those of us on YouTube and multimedia, those who do videos, 
we need your help. Do videos of your own. Show a strong presence on social media for secularism. If they come up with a bullshit argument, counter the bullshit argument. If you hadn't done a video yet, do one now. Show that our numbers are greater. Show that our commitment is equal or greater than. Because when you don't, when you fall behind the voice that is the loudest, doesn't mean it's the voice that is right. If you disagree, disagree. Don't be a weak, mild lamb going to slaughter, hoping for the best. Speak up, speak out, speak often. <sighs> That's all I can think of right now. If you have any ideas of your own, please share them down below. Till next time, I'll leave a link for Jim's channel. Sorry if I missed a few names. Bye.